All right, let's start off at the bottom and we'll work our way up, okay? Because there's a lot of stuff to talk about here. Um, right, right here, okay. All right, so we kind of already went over this a little bit. These were from the last interview, but um, yeah, so chapter 12, there's going to be five Hi, endings. Greece, how are you? Five endings in chapter 12. I'm good. How are you doing? So I'm very excited for that. That's awesome. Five whole endings. Uh, yo, Alexa, turn off the fans. Alexa, turn off the fans. She never listens to me the first time, dude. She never listens to me the first time. All right. And then chapter 11 is going to be big. I think the character focus chapter. So, yeah, uh, we're going to be getting two character focus chapters. So here's how it's going to work. OK, yeah, there's going to be five endings in chapter 12 um, and none of them are going to be a bad ending. Uh, they're all going to be endings. Some of them are going to be sad. Some of them are going to be, you know, like actual endings. Uh, it all depends what you choose, right? There's not going to be an ending where you just, uh, you just get oofed like you do in the plant bad ending. So yeah, five different endings. That's a lot, dude. I, I, I th that's a lot. I, friends, this could be crazy. An it's gonna be crazy. Manner. Is this normal? Uh, no, you should run him over with a golf cart. That's what you should do. Um, yeah, chapter 11 is gonna be big. So for the people that don't know, here's how it's gonna work. Okay, let me explain how this is gonna work. So we're gonna be getting chapter 11 next week. Okay, next week's gonna be chapter 11. Okay, and then um one week after that i believe uh or a few weeks after that we're going to be getting a character focused chapter like distorted memory and then one week after that we're going to get another chapter so we're going to get two chapters in two weeks uh and those are going to be the character focused chapters and then after those come out mini tunes going to work on chapter 12 for a month so if we get chapter 11 here then we may get the character focus chapters here which means chapter 12 would probably come out around uh the beginning of october or something like that so pretty pretty awesome yeah that's pretty awesome there i like that okay um mini tunes least favorite map is book two chapter four the safe place what is your guys's least favorite map in um in book two what is your least favorite map in book two? Before I say mine, um, you guys say yours. Uh, what is your least favorite one? The end of book two is near. Uh, it's getting there. It's getting there. Uh, store, safe place, alleys. I li I don't mind the alleys. You know what? I think my problem with the alleys is there's so much running back and forth at the end. If the inn didn't have so much running back and forth, because you got to use the scissors again, you got to use the mop again, you got to use the screwdriver, like you got to use all these things again. And if you didn't have to do that, it probably wouldn't be as bad. But I think my least favorite one is also the safe place. It's just very cramped and there's a lot of running back and forth. There's a lot of running back and forth in that one. Um, anyway, uh, the inspiration for Piggy Book 2 Chapter 8's design was a boat from Half-Life 2. Uh, we already know that. Um, let's see. Here we go. Yeah. Book two, chapter 12. It's going to take five weeks to build. The true ending will be more interactive than the last one. I am so excited for the true ending, dude. Streaming that was one of the most fun things I've ever done. I, I loved streaming the true ending in book one. I am 100% going to be streaming the true ending in book two. It's going to be so much fun. I cannot wait. I will literally be live all day long, just like we always do. Uh, it's going to be super duper fun. Um, and it's going to be a lot harder than the last one. So I'm really excited for that. I'm curious how long it's going to take because the last one took four days. Four days of eight hour streams every single day before we found it. And I wonder, I like, everyone's gotten a lot better at like, um, at looking for stuff, right? Like everyone's gotten a lot better at solving puzzles. So I'm curious how long it's going to take. It may not take as long. Um, let's see. So here we go. Uh, Mini Tune had initially thought about leaving the skin from the... Wait, what? Uh, oh, the, the yeah, the spider was going to be a Halloween skin and then he decided to put it in the temple map. Yeah, that was going to be that was going to be a Halloween skin there is what that was going to be. All right, here we go. So this is the new stuff right here. Here's the new stuff. Here, here's the new stuff. We can expect another vocal song for Piggy Book 2 Chapter 12. So we're going to be getting another song in Chapter 12. That's like the one in Chapter 6 with Willow, uh, which is cool because I really like that song. That was really good. So I am 100% down to have another one of those. That's super duper awesome. Uh, what did you guys think about the song in chapter uh, chapter 12? I mean, chapter 6. I think it was really good. Yeah, Willow's song. Yeah, that was super duper awesome. It's your birthday. Happy birthday, uh, Krister. Krister, happy birthday. Hopefully you have a, uh, have a good birthday there. 
It was really good. Yeah, sip. It was good. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. All right, what do we got here? Uh, an announcement for the DLC codes will come out really soon, according to Minitune. I really hope they come out today. That would be awesome. <laughs> that would be that would be super duper awesome. Man. I cannot wait for these. We're gonna be get, able to get different skins, so we're gonna have like a red uh, clowny. We're gonna have like a, a black suit um, uh, soldier and all this other stuff. So I'm really excited for those. I think it's gonna be awesome. I'm gonna be doing some giveaways for those, like I've been saying. So make sure you're subscribed, uh, cause I'm gonna be giving those out to uh, some subscribers. Gonna be awesome. Um, Piggy Inner City is going to start with your character's backstory. There will be some crossovers between both games. However, it'll mainly follow your OC's backstory. So basically what this means is, um, you're going to make your own character in Piggy Inner City, and then you're going to learn the backstory of your character, and then your character will meet the characters from the main Piggy game. So they'll meet, you know, Georgie, maybe Pony, maybe Zizzy, maybe Mr. P or something like that. So that's cool. I like that. Uh, I like being able to, um, like, make my own character. I think that's super awesome. Because uh, then you can, like, come up with your own story for your own character and, like, make your character... Like, maybe my character is, like, an ex-assassin, you know? Like, he's an ex-assassin that got addicted to Fortnite. And because he got addicted to Fortnite, he, he had to quit being an assassin. And then one day he woke up and there was an apocalypse. There was a piggy infection. And now we have the Fortnite assassin. And that's that's my character right there. <laughs> yeah, there you go. That's my character. That's, my, that's his backstory. Uh, oh, I like this one a lot. This one's really good. This one's really good. Uh, we may return to book one maps for the character focused chapters. So Minitune said that he's going to be reusing some old chapters for the character focused ones, which means we may be going back in time to a um, not literally, but figuratively going back in time uh, to play on a book one map again in, in like a different way. So it's like it's going to be like a different version of a book one map. So I'm very excited about that. Kind of like distorted memory. Uh, what book one map would you guys like to go back to and play again? But like get it remixed, right? Like a remixed version. Let me know in the chat. I think, hmm, I think I would love to see a, hmm, that's tough, dude. That's tough. Uh, I would love to see, yo, why my hair looking bald right now? Hold on a second. Uh, let me fix that. Wait, 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 wait a second here. Uh, okay. All right. That's a little bit, that's a little bit better. I would like to see, um... Ooh, the forest would be interesting. Um, I think I'm gonna go with the city. The city, I think, would be or the metro. Yeah, metro would be cool too. That would be. Oh yeah, a gallery. Get like a revamped gallery. That'd be kind of cool. Where you could go outside the gallery and see your car or something. That'd be kind of neat. Okay. All right. What else we got going on here? Um, Piggy Inner City will have a map update. Yeah. So Mini Tomb basically said that um, the map is going to have a huge update he's going to be redoing the whole map and making it um you know like an actual map instead of just uh having random places all over the bed uh like uh, random maps all over the place right so yeah uh, uh, of course of course of course yeah duh, duh all right um the acid from the station and inner city was removed for gameplay reasons okay now this is the interesting thing okay let's talk about this <laughs> let's talk about this for a second Okay, let's talk about this for a second here. All right, the piggy movie. All right, the piggy movie. Okay, so uh, Minitune got asked if he would ever make a piggy movie in the future. And uh, he basically said he would love to, but the only problem is he'd have to figure out like what he would want to do. He said it would have its own like original storyline. So it would have like its own story. It wouldn't necessarily like be an exact copy of the game or anything. It would be like its own story, like maybe like new characters or something like that. Who knows, right? Um, and he also said that the one thing, now I don't know if Minitune's ever going to see this, but if he does, here's the deal. All right, here's the dealio. So Minitune said that one of the biggest issues with making a Piggy movie is obviously Piggy is like, it's not like a Michael Myers movie. It's not rated R or anything like that. It would be like a, a kid's horror movie, kind of, right? And he said he didn't know of any kid's horror movies. And I was thinking, I was like, if he's going to make a piggy movie, he should totally make it like this movie here. 
Uh, let me know if you guys have ever seen this movie. This is one of my favorite movies as a kid. It's a it's a kid scary movie. Uh, it's a scary movie uh, with kids, and um, yeah, it's it's great. This is it right here. I think if he ever does a piggy movie, he should make it like this. I really like that movie. Uh, I I think I think that would fit perfectly, dude. Kind of like a, a comical. Have you guys seen this movie? You guys seen this? Stranger Things? I, I know a lot of kids watch Stranger Things, but I wouldn't really classify it as a kid's show. But, I mean, sure, yeah. Yeah, yeah, Monster House isn't your favorite, but wow. Yeah, Minitune, if you're watching this, right there. Watch that movie, and then make the piggy movie like that. I think that'd be super cool, dude. That'd be super cool. That'd be super duper awesome. Yeah, if a piggy movie came out, would you guys go and see it? I I, I, I want to be a cameo. I want to be a cameo. I'll be, I'll be like a cameo voice line. I'll be in the background being eaten like, ah! you know, something like that. <laughs> That'd be super awesome. That'd be super cool, dude. I, I, I doubt it would be on like movie theaters or something, um, but I could see something coming to like Netflix or something like that. That would be, uh, that would certainly be interesting. I'd be down with that. I'd be down with that. Um, let's see what else he talked about. Oh yeah, the note, there's a note in chapter one the alleys that says can k come out to play minitune has confirmed that the k is not kona so we still don't know who that is we still don't know who that is uh, we may be going back in time for the character focused chapters i believe that this means alleys um and that we're literally going back to a flashback so we may be going back to the alleys map for like a flashback that might be kind of cool maybe we'll see whenever um whenever daisy left or something like that that would be interesting uh, oh yeah, this one's interesting. Minitune has considered changing the piggy theme for book one to original themes, but he he hasn't yet due to nostalgia. Uh, would you guys want Minitune to change the main piggy theme uh, to like an original song, or 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 not? Nah? Yay or or nay there? Yay or nay? Uh, what's up, Jire? How you doing? How many paper cuts? I've done a lot of paper. I, I've had a lot of paper cuts in my day. No. I'm going to say yes, just because the main audio always gets flagged. Like whenever like I have to mute the main audio um, in videos because it's copyrighted and it's a really big pain in the booty uh, getting the copyright removed. Like it takes it, it, it takes a few days for that to happen. Um, it, it's a big pain in the booty. So I'm going to say yes, uh, just because of that. But uh, I don't really mind either way. Like, I can just mute it. It's not a big deal. Uh, book 2, Chapter 12. Your emotions will depend on what ending you get. Yeah, somebody's going to die. Somebody somebody in one of the endings. Some, dude, what if one of the endings, everybody just died? And that was the end of Piggy. <laughs> like, you got the bad ending and everybody just died. Like, that's it. It's over. Everybody's dead. That's it. it, it Pony dies. Izzy dies. Player dies. George, everybody dies. <laughs> end of the end of the game gg oh man that would be uh that'd be pretty cool right there okay so let's talk about the leaks um let's talk about the leaks real quick or the Coraline movie yeah that's another one. Oh yeah i gotta talk about something guys i gotta talk about something um so you guys know on friday roblox is doing the ksi concert right well roblox messaged me and uh, I asked them, I was like, can I live stream it? Like, can I live stream the concert? And they said, no. And I was like, oh, no, what do you mean? I was really upset. So I did the one thing that I'm really good at. And I complained about it on Twitter. Uh, I, I, I sent a tweet out and I complained about it. And I said, I said, uh, I'm really disappointed. Uh, Fortnite lets me stream their concerts. Why can't I live stream the Roblox one? And then KSI responded to me. KSI literally responded to me, dude. He literally responded to me. Like, no joke. Uh, he said, why aren't you allowed to stream it? And I was like, Roblox told me no. And then he said, don't worry about it. You can stream it. <laughs> So guess what we doing on Friday night? We live streaming the KSI concert. 
because KSI told us we could. So that's what we're going to do. Uh, yeah, very, very excited about that. I was like, dude, I was I was just laying there. I was like, oh, my God, dude, KSI responded to me on Twitter, dude. So I'm very excited about that. We're going to be streaming that. That's going to be fun. Very excited about that. I love, <laughs> I love that Roblox said no, and then KSI said yes. It was like... It's like whenever you ask your mom something, and you like, like you want to go to McDonald's, and you're like, Mom, can I go to McDonald's? And she says, No. So you go and ask your dad, and you're like, Dad, can I go to McDonald's? And he says, Yes. That's basically what I did. My mom is Roblox, and KSI is the dad. I, I was like, Hey, hey Roblox, hey, hey, can I can I live stream this? And they were like, No. And I was like, Fine, I'll go ask Dad. Then I was like, Hey, hey KSI, can I live stream this? He's like, Yeah. I'm like, Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's basically what happened that's basically what happened dude oh it's so funny but yeah that'll be fun i'm very excited about that all right anyway uh let's talk about the leaks real quick let's go on over to here all right so here we go the leaks all right here it is here it is here it is so uh let me just go to tweets and replies real quick and is this it right here yeah all right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Okay. So let's talk about this. Ooh, five emojis this time. Chapter 11. All right, all right. So we got a skull. We got an up arrow. We have a flashlight. An electric torch. Does that say an electric torch? That's a flashlight, not an electric torch. Who in the world calls it an electric torch? What? I, who, who calls it an electric torch? It's a flashlight. What do you mean? Uh, nobody says, hey, hand me the electric torch. What in the world? All right, let's see. We got an ice cube and we have a soldier hat. Okay. So the skull. All right, let's talk about the skull. Um, I'm pretty sure the skull is going to... Actually, what do you guys think the skull means real quick? I'm going to ask you guys and then, and then I'll say what I think it means. All right, so you guys go ahead and say in the chat what you guys think the skull means. And, uh, and then I'll say what I think it means. Yeah, what do you guys what do you guys think the skull means here? Skull is death. Yeah, so I think what's going on is I think it it says that everybody at the military post is is dead. Basically, everyone at the outpost is dead, which it kind of already said that in a note. There was a note that said that the outpost went silent. Um and so I'm pretty sure it went silent because everybody's dead. Um and then of course the military helmet, it's a military base. Uh Duh, you know, uh, I, I don't think there's going to be Krispy Kreme employees there. So, uh, yeah, it would make sense for uh, the military to be there. Um, now, the up arrow, I have no idea what in the world this means. Um, is there going to be an elevator, maybe an elevator that carries you up and down? Uh, I have no idea. What do you guys think the up arrow means up north? Oh, up north. You're going up north. That's true. I didn't even think about that. We're going up north. Yeah, okay. I think you're probably right. That's probably right. That's probably right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Heaven, I, I don't think we're going to be going to heaven in this chapter unless everybody dies. <laughs> this, I don't think that's going to happen. Uh, it probably means going up north. Yeah, okay. Uh, now, the flashlight is interesting. I wonder if we're gonna be getting like a dark chapter, like where you have to, um, you have to, uh, like have a flashlight, you know, like you can't see, right? I think that would be interesting. I think that would be really interesting. You know what I'm saying? Like it's dark, like a dark map, and you have to get like a flashlight to see, and, and it's like super scary. That would be super cool, dude. That would be super cool. Yeah, kind of like the mimic or something like that, right? Uh, flashlight would be light the beacon. Uh, I don't know about that one. I think that'd probably be more like a torch or something. Uh, imagine Roblox asking KSI to not talk in favor of streamers. I know it's probably, I probably made it so awkward for Roblox. I, they, they were like, Creek, I just said no. And then you ask KSI and KSI said yes. And now, now we don't know what to do. <laughs> uh, but now we got the ice cube. Uh, I don't know what the ice cube means. Uh, obviously, it's snowing, but just because it's snowing doesn't mean that there's going to be ice cubes. Unless there's going to be like a freezer. Maybe there's like a freezer or something. Or, or maybe parts of the map are frozen and you have to like burn it. You have to like melt parts of the map or something. I, I don't know. Um, yeah, maybe like an ice cube or something like that. 
It's somewhere around there. Freezer map. Maybe you go into a freezer. Maybe it's got to be like a polar bear. Frost Iggy. Something like that. Frozen map. Yeah, like a, like a dark frozen map. That'd be kind of cool.